Rigid body dynamics studies the movement of systems of interconnected bodies under the action of external forces. The assumption that the bodies are rigid, which means that they do not deform under the action of applied forces, simplifies the analysis by reducing the parameters that describe the configuration of the system to the translation and rotation of reference frames attached to each body. This excludes bodies that display fluid, highly elastic, and plastic behavior. The dynamics of a rigid body system is described by the laws of kinematics and by the application of Newton's second law kinetics or their derivative form Lagrangian mechanics. The solution of these equations of motion provides a description of the position, the motion and the acceleration of the individual components of the system and overall the system itself, as a function of time. The formulation and solution of rigid body dynamics is an important tool in the computer simulation of mechanical systems. Planar rigid body dynamics If a system of particles moves parallel to a fixed plane, the system is said to be constrained to planar movement. In this case, Newton's laws kinetics for a rigid system of n particles, π, i equals 1 n, simplify because there is no movement in the k direction. Determine the resultant force and torque at a reference point R, to obtain f equals i equals 1 n m i a i t equals i equals 1 n r i minus r times m i a I Display style Math BF F equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I Math BF O underscore I quad Math BF T equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Math BF R underscore I Math BF R times M underscore I Math BF O underscore I where re denotes the planar trajectory of each particle. The kinematics of a rigid body yields the formula for the acceleration of the particle π in terms of the position r and acceleration a of the reference particle as well as the angular velocity vector ω and angular acceleration vector α of the rigid system of particles as a i equals α times r i minus r plus Omega times Omega times R I minus R plus a display style math BF underscore I equals alpha times math BF R underscore I math BF R plus Omega times Omega times math BF R underscore I math BF R plus math BF a for systems that are constrained to planar movement, the angular velocity and angular acceleration vectors are directed along k perpendicular to the plane of movement, which simplifies this acceleration equation. In this case, the acceleration vectors can be simplified by introducing the unit vectors a from the reference point r to a point re and the unit vectors t i equals k times e i Text style Math BF T underscore I equals K times Math BF E underscore I So A I equals Alpha Delta R I T I minus Omega two Delta R I E I plus a display style math bf o underscore i equals alpha delta r underscore i math bf t underscore i omega caret two delta r underscore i math bf e underscore i plus math bf a. This yields the resultant force on the system as f equals alpha i equals one N M 
I delta R I T I minus Omega two I equals one N M I delta R I E I plus I equals one N M I A Display style math BFF equals alpha sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I delta R underscore I math BF T underscore I omega carrot two sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I delta R underscore I math BF E underscore I plus sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I math BF and torque is T equals I equals 1 n m i delta r i e i times alpha delta r i t i minus omega 2 delta r I E I plus a equals I equals one N M I delta R I two alpha K plus I equals one N M I delta R I E I times a Display style math BF T equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I delta R underscore I math BF E underscore I times alpha delta R underscore I math BF T underscore I omega carrot two delta R underscore I math BF E underscore I plus math BF equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I delta R underscore I carrot two alpha VEC K plus sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I delta R underscore I math BF E underscore I times math BF where E I times E I equals zero Text style math BF E underscore I times math BF E underscore I equals zero and E I times T I equals K text style math BF e underscore I times math BF T underscore I equals K is the unit vector perpendicular to the plane for all of the particles pi use the center of mass C as the reference point so these equations for Newton's laws simplify to become F equals M a T equals I C alpha K display style math BF F equals M math BF a quad math BF T equals I underscore C alpha VEC K where M is the total mass and I C is the moment of inertia about an axis perpendicular to the movement of the rigid system and through the center of mass Rigid body in three dimensions Orientation or attitude descriptions Several methods to describe orientations of a rigid body in three dimensions have been developed. They are summarized in the following sections. Topic: Euler angles. 
The first attempt to represent an orientation is attributed to Leonard Euler. He imagined three reference frames that could rotate one around the other, and realized that by starting with a fixed reference frame and performing three rotations, he could get any other reference frame in the space using two rotations to fix the vertical axis and other to fix the other two axes. The values of these three rotations are called Euler angles. Tate-Brian angles These are three angles, also known as yaw, pitch and roll, navigation angles and cardan angles. Mathematically they constitute a set of six possibilities inside the twelve possible sets of Euler angles, the ordering being the one best used for describing the orientation of a vehicle such as an airplane. In aerospace engineering they are usually referred to as Euler angles. Topic. Orientation vector Euler also realized that the composition of two rotations is equivalent to a single rotation about a different fixed axis Euler's rotation theorem. Therefore, the composition of the former three angles has to be equal to only one rotation, whose axis was complicated to calculate until matrices were developed. Based on this fact he introduced a vectorial way to describe any rotation, with a vector on the rotation axis and module equal to the value of the angle. Therefore, any orientation can be represented by a rotation vector also called Euler vector that leads to it from the reference frame. When used to represent an orientation, the rotation vector is commonly called orientation vector, or attitude vector. A similar method, called axis angle representation, describes a rotation or orientation using a unit vector aligned with the rotation axis, and a separate value to indicate the angle see figure. <laughs> <laughs> Orientation matrix With the introduction of matrices the Euler theorems were rewritten. The rotations were described by orthogonal matrices referred to as rotation matrices or direction cosine matrices. When used to represent an orientation, a rotation matrix is commonly called orientation matrix, or attitude matrix. The above-mentioned Euler vector is the eigenvector of a rotation matrix a rotation matrix has a unique real eigenvalue. The product of two rotation matrices is the composition of rotations. Therefore, as before, the orientation can be given as the rotation from the initial frame to achieve the frame that we want to describe. The configuration space of a non-symmetrical object in n-dimensional space is so n times rn. Orientation may be visualized by attaching a basis of tangent vectors to an object. The direction in which each vector points determines its orientation. Topic. Orientation quaternion Another way to describe rotations is using rotation quaternions, also called versors. They are equivalent to rotation matrices and rotation vectors. With respect to rotation vectors, they can be more easily converted to and from matrices. When used to represent orientations, rotation quaternions are typically called orientation quaternions or attitude quaternions. Topic. Newton's second law in three dimensions To consider rigid body dynamics in three-dimensional space, Newton's second law must be extended to define the relationship between the movement of a rigid body and the system of forces and torques that act on it. Newton formulated his second law for a particle as the change of motion of an object is proportional to the force impressed and is made in the direction of the straight line in which the force is impressed." Because Newton generally referred to mass times velocity as the «motion» of a particle, the phrase «change of motion» refers to the mass times acceleration of the particle, and so this law is usually written as F equals M A Display style math bf f equals m math bf a, where f is understood to be the only external force acting on the particle, m is the mass of the particle, and a is its acceleration vector. The extension of Newton's second law to rigid bodies is achieved by considering a rigid system of particles. Topic: <laughs> Rigid system of particles. 
if a system of n particles pi i equals 1 n are assembled into a rigid body then newton's second law can be applied to each of the particles in the body if phi is the external force applied to particle pi with mass me then f i plus j equals 1 n f i j equals m i a i i equals 1 N display style math bff underscore i plus sum underscore j equals one caret n math bff underscore i j equals m underscore i math bff underscore i quad i equals one l dots n, where f i j is the internal force of particle p j acting on particle pi that maintains the constant distance between these particles. An important simplification to these force equations is obtained by introducing the resultant force and torque that acts on the rigid system. This resultant force and torque is obtained by choosing one of the particles in the system as a reference point, R, where each of the external forces are applied with the addition of an associated torque. The resultant force F and torque T are given by the formulas F equals I equals 1 n f i t equals i equals 1 n r i minus r times f i Display style math bff equals sum underscore i equals one caret n math bff underscore i quad math bft equals sum underscore i equals one caret n math bf r underscore i math bf r times math bff underscore i, where re is the vector that defines the position of particle pi. Newton's second law for a particle combines with these formulas for the resultant force and torque to yield f equals i equals 1 n m i a i t equals i equals 1 n r i minus r times m i a I display style math bff equals sum underscore i equals one caret n m underscore i math bf o underscore i quad math bf t equals sum underscore i equals one caret n math bf r underscore i math bf r times m underscore i math bf o underscore i where the internal forces f i j cancel in pairs. The kinematics of a rigid body yields the formula for the acceleration of the particle π in terms of the position r and acceleration of the reference particle as well as the angular velocity vector ω and angular acceleration vector α of the rigid system of particles as a i equals α times r i minus r plus Omega times Omega times R I minus R plus a display style math BF a underscore I equals alpha times math BF R underscore I math BF R plus Omega times Omega times math BF R underscore I math BF R plus math BF a Topic. Mass properties The mass properties of the rigid body are represented by its center of mass and inertia matrix. Choose the reference point R so that it satisfies the condition I equals 1 N M I R I minus R equals 0 
Display style sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I Math BF R underscore I Math BF R equals zero. Then it is known as the center of mass of the system. The inertia matrix IR of the system relative to the reference point R is defined by I R equals I equals one N M I I S I T S I minus S I S I T Display style I underscore R equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I Math BF I Math BF S underscore I carrot T Math BF S underscore I Math BF S underscore I Math BF S underscore I carrot T where S I Display style Math BF S underscore I is the column vector re R and S I T display style math BFS underscore I carrot T is its transpose s I T s I display style math BFS underscore I carrot T math BFS underscore I is the scalar product of s I Display style math bf s underscore i with itself while s i s i t display style math bf s underscore i math bf s underscore i caret t is the tensor product of s i display style math bf s underscore i with itself i Display style math bf i is the three by three identity matrix. Topic: Force torque equations. Using the center of mass and inertia matrix, the force and torque equations for a single rigid body take the form F equals m a t equals i r alpha plus omega times i r omega display style math bf f equals m math bf a quad math bf t equals i underscore r alpha plus omega times i underscore r omega and are known as newton's second law of motion for a rigid body the dynamics of an interconnected system of rigid bodies by j equals 1 m is formulated by isolating each rigid body and introducing the interaction forces the resultant of the external and interaction forces on each body yields the force torque equations f j equals m j a j t j equals i r j alpha j plus omega j times i r j omega j j equals 1 m Display style math bf f underscore j equals m underscore j math bf o underscore j quad math bf t underscore j equals i underscore r underscore j alpha underscore j plus omega underscore j times i underscore r underscore j omega underscore j quad j equals one l dots m Newton's formulation yields six m equations that define the dynamics of a system of m rigid bodies. Topic: Rotation in three dimensions. When a rotating object is under the influence of torques, it exhibits the behaviors of precession and nutation. 
The fundamental equation describing the behavior of a rotating solid body is tau equals d l d t equals d l d t plus omega times l equals d i omega d t plus omega times i omega equals i alpha plus omega times i omega Display style bold symbol tau equals d math bf l over dt equals d math bf l over dt plus bold symbol omega times math bf l equals d i bold symbol omega over dt plus bold symbol omega times i bold symbol omega equals i bold symbol alpha plus bold symbol omega times i bold symbol omega where the pseudovectors tau and l are, respectively, the torques on the body and its angular momentum, the scalar i is its moment of inertia, the vector omega is its angular velocity, the vector alpha is its angular acceleration, d is the differential in an inertial reference frame and d is the differential in a relative reference frame fixed with the body. It follows from this that a torque tau applied perpendicular to the axis of rotation, and therefore perpendicular to L, results in a rotation about an axis perpendicular to both tau and L. This motion is called precession. The angular velocity of precession omega p is given by the cross product tau equals omega p times L. Display style bold symbol tau equals bold symbol omega underscore mathrm p times math bf l. Precession can be demonstrated by placing a spinning top with its axis horizontal and supported loosely, frictionless toward precession at one end. Instead of falling, as might be expected, the top appears to defy gravity by remaining with its axis horizontal, when the other end of the axis is left unsupported and the free end of the axis slowly describes a circle in a horizontal plane, the resulting precession turning. This effect is explained by the above equations. The torque on the top is supplied by a couple of forces, gravity acting downward on the device's center of mass, and an equal force acting upward to support one end of the device. The rotation resulting from this torque is not downward, as might be intuitively expected, causing the device to fall, but perpendicular to both the gravitational torque horizontal and perpendicular to the axis of rotation and the axis of rotation horizontal and outwards from the point of support, i.e., about a vertical axis, causing the device to rotate slowly about the supporting point. Under a constant torque of magnitude tau, the speed of precession omega p is inversely proportional to L, the magnitude of its angular momentum. Tau equals omega p L sin theta. Display style tau equals mathet omega underscore mathrm p L sin theta. Where theta is the angle between the vectors omega p and l, thus, if the top spin slows down, for example, due to friction, its angular momentum decreases and so the rate of precession increases. This continues until the device is unable to rotate fast enough to support its own weight, when it stops precessing and falls off its support, mostly because friction against precession causes another precession that goes to cause the fall. By convention, these three vectors, torque, spin, and precession, are all oriented with respect to each other according to the right-hand rule. <laughs> Virtual work of forces acting on a rigid body An alternate formulation of rigid body dynamics that has a number of convenient features is obtained by considering the virtual work of forces acting on a rigid body. The virtual work of forces acting at various points on a single rigid body can be calculated using the velocities of their point of application and the resultant force and torque. To see this, let the forces F1, F2, Fn act on the points R1, R2, Rn in a rigid body. The trajectories of Re, I equals 1, N are defined by the movement of the rigid body. The velocity of the points re along their trajectories are 
v i equals omega times r i minus r plus v Display style math bf v underscore i equals vec omega times math bf r underscore i math bf r plus math bf v, where omega is the angular velocity vector of the body. Topic: Virtual work. Work is computed from the dot product of each force with the displacement of its point of contact. Delta W equals I equals one N F I Delta R I Display style Delta W equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Math BF F underscore I C D O T Delta Math BF R underscore I if the trajectory of a rigid body is defined by a set of generalized coordinates q j, j equals 1 m, then the virtual displacements delta re are given by delta r i equals j equals 1 m r i q j delta Q J equals J equals one M V I Q J Delta Q J Display style delta math bf r underscore i equals sum underscore j equals one caret m f r a c partial math bf r underscore i partial q underscore j delta q underscore j equals sum underscore j equals one caret m f r a c partial math bf v underscore i partial dot q underscore j delta q underscore j the virtual work of this system of forces acting on the body in terms of the generalized coordinates becomes delta w equals f 1 j equals 1 m v 1 q j delta q j plus plus f n j equals 1 m v n q j delta q j Display style delta W equals Math BF F underscore one C D O T left sum underscore J equals one carrot M F R A C partial Math BF V underscore one partial dot Q underscore J delta Q underscore J right plus L dots plus Math BF F underscore N C D O T sum underscore J equals one carrot M F R A C partial Math BF V underscore N partial dot Q underscore J delta Q underscore J or collecting the coefficients of delta Q J delta W equals I equals one N F I V I Q one delta Q one plus plus 1 equals 1 n f i v i q m delta q m 
Display style delta w equals left sum underscore i equals one caret n math b f f underscore i c d o t f r a c partial math b f v underscore i partial dot q underscore one right delta q underscore one plus l dots plus sum underscore one equals one caret n math b f f underscore i c d o t f r a c partial math b f v underscore i partial dot q underscore m delta q underscore M. Topic: Generalized forces. For simplicity, consider a trajectory of a rigid body that is specified by a single generalized coordinate q, such as a rotation angle. Then the formula becomes delta w equals i equals one. N F I V I Q Delta Q equals I equals one N F I Omega times R I minus R plus V Q delta Q display style delta W equals left sum underscore I equals one carrot n math B F F underscore I C D O T F R A C partial math B F V underscore I partial dot Q right delta Q equals left sum underscore I equals one carrot n math B F F underscore I C D O T F R A C partial V E C Omega times math B F R underscore I math B F R plus math B F V partial dot Q right delta Q introduce the resultant force F and torque T so this equation takes the form delta W equals F V Q plus T Omega Q delta Q Display style delta W equals left Math BF F C D O T F R A C partial Math BF V partial dot Q plus Math BF T C D O T F R A C partial V E C Omega partial dot Q right delta Q The quantity Q defined by Q equals F V Q plus T Omega Q Display style Q equals Math BF F C D O T F R A C partial Math BF V partial dot Q plus Math BF T C D O T F R A C partial V E C Omega partial dot Q is known as the generalized force associated with the virtual displacement delta Q. This formula generalizes to the movement of a rigid body defined by more than one generalized coordinate, that is Delta W equals J equals one M Q J delta Q J Display style delta W equals sum underscore J equals one carrot M Q underscore J delta Q underscore J where Q J equals F V Q J plus T Omega Q J J equals one M Display style Q underscore J equals Math BF F C D O T F R A C partial Math BF V partial dot Q underscore J plus Math BF T C D O T F R A C partial V E C Omega partial dot Q underscore J quad J equals one L dots M it is useful to note that conservative forces such as gravity and spring forces are derivable from a potential function V Q1 Qn, known as a potential energy. In this case the generalized forces are given by Q J 
equals minus v q j j equals 1 m display style q underscore j equals frac partial v partial q underscore j quad j equals 1 l dots m topic d'alembert's form of the principle of virtual work The equations of motion for a mechanical system of rigid bodies can be determined using d'Alembert's form of the principle of virtual work. The principle of virtual work is used to study the static equilibrium of a system of rigid bodies, however by introducing acceleration terms in Newton's laws this approach is generalized to define dynamic equilibrium. Topic: <laughs> Static equilibrium The static equilibrium of a mechanical system rigid bodies is defined by the condition that the virtual work of the applied forces is zero for any virtual displacement of the system. This is known as the principle of virtual work. This is equivalent to the requirement that the generalized forces for any virtual displacement are zero, that is chi equals zero. Let a mechanical system be constructed from n rigid bodies, by, i equals one, N, and let the resultant of the applied forces on each body be the force torque pairs, phi and t, i equals 1 N. Notice that these applied forces do not include the reaction forces where the bodies are connected. Finally, assume that the velocity v and angular velocities omega i, i equals 1 N, for each rigid body, are defined by a single generalized coordinate q. Such a system of rigid bodies is said to have one degree of freedom. The virtual work of the forces and torques, phi and t, applied to this one degree of freedom system is given by delta w equals i equals 1 n f i v i q plus t i omega i Q delta Q equals Q delta Q display style delta W equals sum underscore I equals one carrot n math BF F underscore I C D O T F R A C partial math BF V underscore I partial dot Q plus math BF T underscore I C D O T F R A C partial V E C Omega underscore I partial dot Q delta Q equals Q delta Q where Q equals I equals one N F I V I Q plus T I Omega I Q Display style Q equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Math BF F underscore I C D O T F R A C partial Math BF V underscore I partial dot Q plus Math BF T underscore I C D O T F R A C partial V E C Omega underscore I partial dot Q is the generalized force acting on this one degree of freedom system. If the mechanical system is defined by m generalized coordinates, qj, j equals 1 m, then the system has m degrees of freedom and the virtual work is given by delta w equals j equals 1 m q j delta q j Display style delta W equals sum underscore J equals one carrot M Q underscore J delta Q underscore J where Q J equals I equals one N F I V I Q J plus T 
I Omega I Q J J equals one M Display style Q underscore J equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N Math BF F underscore I C D O T F R A C partial Math BF V underscore I partial dot Q underscore J plus Math BF T underscore I C D O T F R A C partial V E C Omega underscore I partial dot Q underscore J quad J equals one L dots M is the generalized force associated with the generalized coordinate qj. The principle of virtual work states that static equilibrium occurs when these generalized forces acting on the system are zero, that is q j equals zero j equals one m Display style q underscore j equals zero quad j equals one l dots m. These m equations define the static equilibrium of the system of rigid bodies. Topic: Generalized inertia forces. Consider a single rigid body which moves under the action of a resultant force F and torque T, with one degree of freedom defined by the generalized coordinate Q. Assume the reference point for the resultant force and torque is the center of mass of the body, then the generalized inertia force Q** associated with the generalized coordinate Q is given by Q equals minus m a v Q minus I R alpha plus Omega times I R Omega Omega Q Display style q caret asterisk equals m math bf a c d o t f r a c partial math bf v partial dot q i underscore r alpha plus omega times i underscore r omega c d o t f r a c partial v e c omega partial dot q. This inertia force can be computed from the kinetic energy of the rigid body. T equals one. 2 m v v plus 1 2 omega i r omega Display style t equals frac 1 2 m math bf v c d o t math bf v plus frac 1 2 vec omega c d o t i underscore r vec omega. By using the formula q equals minus d d t t q minus T Q Display style Q carrot asterisk equals left FRAC D D T FRAC partial T partial dot Q FRAC partial T partial Q right. A system of N rigid bodies with M generalized coordinates has the kinetic energy T equals I equals one N one two M V I V I plus one two Omega I I R Omega I Display style t equals sum underscore i equals one carrot n frac one two m math bf v underscore i c d o t math bf v underscore i plus frac one two v e c omega underscore i c d o t i underscore r v e c omega underscore i, which can be used to calculate the m generalized inertia forces. Q j equals Minus d d t t q 
j minus t q j j equals 1 m display style q underscore j caret asterisk equals left frac d dt frac partial t partial dot q underscore j frac partial t partial q underscore j right quad j equals 1 l dots m topic dynamic equilibrium D'Alembert's form of the principle of virtual work states that a system of rigid bodies is in dynamic equilibrium when the virtual work of the sum of the applied forces and the inertial forces is zero for any virtual displacement of the system. Thus, dynamic equilibrium of a system of n rigid bodies with m generalized coordinates requires that delta w equals q one plus q one delta q one plus plus q m plus q m delta q m equals zero Display style delta w equals q underscore one plus q underscore one caret asterisk delta q underscore one plus l dots plus q underscore m plus q underscore m caret asterisk delta q underscore m equals zero for any set of virtual displacements delta q j. This condition yields m equations q j plus q j equals 0 j equals 1 m display style q underscore j plus q underscore j caret asterisk equals 0 quad j equals 1 l dots m which can also be written as d d t t q j minus T Q J equals Q J J equals one M Display style FRAC D DT FRAC partial T partial dot Q underscore J FRAC partial T partial Q underscore J equals Q underscore J quad J equals one L dots M the result is a set of m equations of motion that define the dynamics of the rigid body system. Topic: <laughs> Lagrange's equations. If the generalized forces Qj are derivable from a potential energy V, Q1, Qm, then these equations of motion take the form d d t T Q J minus T Q J equals minus V Q J J equals one M Display style FRAC D D T FRAC partial T partial dot Q underscore J FRAC partial T partial Q underscore J equals FRAC partial V partial Q underscore J quad J equals one L dots M. In this case, introduce the Lagrangian L equals T V, so these equations of motion become D D T L Q J minus L Q J equals zero J equals one M Display style FRAC D DT FRAC partial L partial dot Q underscore J FRAC partial L partial Q underscore J equals zero quad J equals one L dots M 
These are known as Lagrange's equations of motion. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Linear and angular momentum. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> System of particles. The linear and angular momentum of a rigid system of particles is formulated by measuring the position and velocity of the particles relative to the center of mass. Let the system of particles π, i equals 1 and be located at the coordinates ρ and velocities v. Select a reference point r and compute the relative position and velocity vectors r i equals r i minus R plus R V I equals D D T R I minus R plus V Display style Math BF R underscore I equals Math BF R underscore I Math BF R plus Math BF R quad Math BF V underscore I equals FRAC D DT Math BF R underscore I Math BF R plus Math BF V The total linear and angular momentum vectors relative to the reference point R are P equals D D T I equals one N M I R I minus R plus I equals one N M I V Display style math BF P equals FRAC D DT sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I math BF R underscore I math BF R plus sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I math BF V and L equals I equals one N M I R I minus R times D D T R I minus R plus I equals one N M I R I minus r times v Display style Math BF L equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I Math BF R underscore I Math BF R times FRAC D D T Math BF R underscore I Math BF R plus sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I Math BF R underscore I Math BF R times Math BF V If R is chosen as the center of mass these equations simplify to P equals M V L equals I equals one N M I R I minus R times D D T R I Minus R Display style Math BF P equals M Math BF V quad Math BF L equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I Math BF R underscore I Math BF R times FRAC D D T Math BF R underscore I Math BF R Topic Rigid system of particles To specialize these formulas to a rigid body, assume the particles are rigidly connected to each other so π, i equals 1 and are located by the coordinates ρ and velocities v. 
select a reference point r and compute the relative position and velocity vectors r i equals r i minus r plus r v i equals omega times r i minus r plus v Display style math bfr underscore i equals math bfr underscore i math bfr plus math bfr quad math bf v underscore i equals omega times math bfr underscore i math bfr plus math bf v, where omega is the angular velocity of the system. The linear momentum and angular momentum of this rigid system measured relative to the center of mass r is p equals I equals one N M I V L equals I equals one N M I R I minus R times V I equals I equals one N M I R I minus R times Omega times R I minus R Display style math BFP equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I math BF V quad math BF L equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I math BF R underscore I math BF R times math BF V underscore I equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I math BF R underscore I math BF R times Omega times math BF R underscore I math BF R. These equations simplify to become P equals M V L equals I R Omega. Display style Math BF P equals M Math BF V quad Math BF L equals I underscore R Omega where m is the total mass of the system and i r is the moment of inertia matrix defined by i r equals minus i equals 1 n m i r i minus r r i minus r Display style I underscore R equals sum underscore I equals one carrot N M underscore I R underscore I R R underscore I R where re R is the skew symmetric matrix constructed from the vector re R. Topic Applications For the analysis of robotic systems for the biomechanical analysis of animals, humans or humanoid systems For the analysis of space objects For the understanding of strange motions of rigid bodies For the design and development of dynamics-based sensors like gyroscopic sensors etc. For the design and development of various stability enhancement applications in automobiles etc. For improving the graphics of video games which involves rigid bodies See also Analytical mechanics Analytical dynamics Calculus of variations Classical mechanics Dynamics physics, History of classical mechanics Lagrangian mechanics Lagrangian Hamiltonian mechanics Rigid body Rigid rotor Soft body dynamics Multibody dynamics 
Polode Herpolod Procession Poinsett's construction Gyroscope Physics engine Physics processing unit Physics abstraction layer – unified multibody simulator Dynamex – rigid body simulator Rigid chips – Japanese rigid body simulator Euler's equation